Welcome back to Down in the Old Vault. We are once again down in the old sewers. We did have access to the bank there. But you know what? I changed my mind. I don't want to rob a bank. Banks are boring. Uh, no, there's there was talk in somewhere in the sewers. Uh, someone left a note saying it found a key in the water and left it in the storage locker. Which I don't believe I've had the uh, pleasure of being introduced to. So I'm now searching the sewers, the heavily guarded sewers for storage locker. All right, this section is free of guards, thanks to my earlier, what's the word, you know, foresight, planning, yeah, yeah, it was accidental foresight and planning, but still. Thanks to this fellow and uh, his other friend. Oh no, it was just him. The two of them were somewhere else. Alright, that's Fitzgerald's. I could get back to Fitzgerald's. Where else might the storage locker be? I don't think this guard comes all the way up here, right? Uh, maybe I missed it in this room, maybe I missed it in one of these rooms. I should probably check both. I think it's on this, only this one guard who uh, goes up and down here anyway. Yeah, he doesn't come all the way here. Unless there's another key in the water, that's also possible. I should maybe check that. Storage locker. Well, there's something locked away, but it's gears levers that don't work and an archer friend. Here's the note, right? Found a key in the water on patrol. Someone should go over to the bank tomorrow to ask. I put it in the storage locker for now. Where is your storage locker? You're taunting me, aren't you? That's a pipe. It's not a storage locker. I'm almost to the point where... No, well, that's more pipe work. That's also not a storage locker. That's the entire sewers. That's it. I've just been all over it. There's no storage locker here anywhere. Unless it's somehow on the lower floor in the water of one of these places. I can scale the water, see if there's more keys, but I need to wait for this guy to come and go again. Thankfully he takes a long time in there, so I will have the opportunity. <clears throat> if I'm careful and quick. Dang it, I wanted to wait till they shut the door. I should have waited till they shut the door, hello. It's not a key, but it is something in the water that is not useless. I don't think, I don't believe there's a key in there. No storage locker in this room. No storage locker in this room, and definitely no, nothing down below. Is that the room with the archer? No. The archer's through here. Well, I am in the unfortunate position of going into the bank with only two of the keys I need. The other alternative is I could... Wait, what's the western... No, the western door is the one I need to go out. God, don't do that. Don't do that when I'm right behind you. It's cheating. To pirouette when you're being tailgated. Very unfair. The storage locker was not here either.
He goes in there, and it goes round and out again. No, he comes here? What the hell? Oh, he was through my team. God, these guards. They're killing me. What's that? Little antics. <clears throat> oh. Storage. Alright. Well, I did not look there. In my defense, I am stupid. That's it. Your Honor, I plead stupidity. Alright, we'll pick that after this guy's gone through the next time. Because he's on a very short patrol. So we're not going to have too much time to pick it. <clears throat> it's very bright here. Probably a tough lock, right? Right, that's it for the first one. Okay, maybe this will be a third safety deposit box key. I still need four. I still need one more. Maybe there's one in the bank? Maybe... Maybe it'll count if I just collect one of the keys for one of the empty safety deposit boxes, <clears throat> you know? I mean, it fits the rules of the objectives. After all, who's who's making these rules? Surely there's just rules Garrett sets for himself for the stuff he wants to seal, and then when it's too hard, he can just, you know, interpret the rules in a way that's favourable. Ah, oh, shit. What was that? Deposit box key 21. I don't know how I fogged that through the door. That wasn't my plan. I was trying to close the door, but this guy took slightly longer than I expected, so... <laughs> Thankfully, I didn't get into trouble. I'll check the, the place properly in a second. <coughs> right, so there's just various junk. And that key. Good. And now... We have three keys. It'll have to do... We do have the office key. We can get into the bank. We can do most of the bank work. This would be a really good place to end the episode, except we're only seven minutes in. So... It's a very good place for a hard save. We've been not so much in the habit of doing them as I should. Lately, hello. Toilet. Anyone drop anything interesting? Of course, the basement of the bank is heavily guarded. Now, do we have a map of this place? It feels like a basement, right? Yeah, we do have a map of the basement. Uh, to sewers. So, we, this is the bathroom here. This is the way to the sewers. So we can get through there. For all that matters. Let's check out that room. <laughs> Let's see where this guard is going first. Maybe he needs to use the toilet. Oh, he's going away. Well, <laughs> here he is. He's got a nice dark corner here. Oh, hello. Someone threw a crate here with uh, valuable vase to mine. That's very careless of them. Very careless indeed. Someone behind me. Nothing to be seen now. All right, so that's here. It's a big question mark. Question mark. It is thoroughly locked. Alright, and now oh, none of our keys are opening up, right? No, because why would they? Uh, archives, kitchen, power. I wonder if this is where the alarm controls are. Storage seems a good place to check out. Um, kitchen. Let's, let's head, keep heading east here.
don't know where this archer's gonna go, so I'm just gonna wait for him. And he's probably gone into the storage room from the other side, and will come out this side. Seemed like the sort of thing he would do just to spite me. Because I want, I want to go in this door. You did that on purpose, didn't you? Just to spite me. You meanie. Also, there's not much shadow here. That's bad. There's some. More, even worse, there's not much in the way of valuables. Why would you, like, store useless, boring stuff in a storage room instead of valuables? Seriously, now. Maybe it's a valuable carpet there. Probably too heavy. Why are you an archer guarding a storage room? Seriously, now. Although, uh... They are reasonably deadly if you're trying not to be, uh... Too... what's the word? If you're trying to be stealthy, they're obviously a risk. Well, that's not the storage room. Is that you? That's the last time I jump for rats. So hang on. Does he come around there? That's ridiculous, but okay. Mate, you're ridiculous. I, ri I ridicule you. I'm ridicule ri ridiculing you right now. That's a yeah, good work. Uh, that's very convincing. Only the head of security is authorized to disable the alarm. Uh, only the head of security, I guess, has the key to that door. I don't. Whoops. Well, now we know that Archer is going to come in here. Guess I'll wait for him to do so and to go back out again. How strange. Power, so this is where we alarm disable. And we need a key. And we need a key here as well. Good, nobody's in the kitchen. Maybe the carrot will help with my health problem. Nope. Some unvaluable dishes. Oh, hello. Some valuable glasses that I almost missed. Fire arrow. Alright, well, I'll take it. It's not my preferred kind of equipment for a job like this, but... Uh... Um... There's only one guard here. It's probably worth checking out the archives while, while we're in the area, while we're still in the basement. It's not too hard dodging this uh, archer. We can just follow him down this way. And he's gonna head into the storage room anyway. Who goes there? Although it might be nice to have a peek upstairs. Gotta stop jumping at nothing. So he goes in there and comes out here, which means actually I can just run up here without bothering about him too much. This guard is not in the vicinity. <laughs> Who's that laughing at me? Come out, coward. Come out and face me. Right, let's wait for this guard to show. Uh, yeah, he's going heading towards the bathroom, isn't he? Let's follow him. Wait. Oh, where does he go? Does he go into this room? Surely not. I mean, if he does, I better just run on ahead. Yeah, so he does. Although very likely he comes into the archives and I see nowhere to hide. Oh, I see somewhere to hide, okay. Curious about what the thing I saw sticking through the wall there was. 
Why am I hiding here? Because I don't know exactly how long the guard takes for his patrol, and I don't want to go back and look at those corners for anything of interest when someone might just walk in on me. My days of being less cautious are... Well, my minutes of being less cautious are over. It's probably not days worth. I'll be reckless again soon, no doubt. In the meantime, this is all exciting thiefness. Look, there's that horrible giggle again. Trickster's minions. And see, I have plenty of time. I'm just. But now I'm getting impatient. Now's about when I run out, and now's about when the guard comes into the room to catch me getting impatient. You see, that's why he's giggling. He knows. He knows it's going to happen. The Complete History of Muskate District, Chapter 7 As we've explored in the previous chapters, Muskate was for the longest time known to be a place where nature remained untouched. That's why they called it Muskate, because it was made of moss. Even as the city grew around it, up until several centuries ago, the district was a place overgrown with trees and shrubbery. It is no wonder then that it attracted pagans from the city outskirts, despite the Order of the Hammer being at its prime during those years. Perhaps the most interesting case is the Muskate Temple, or as many people know it today, the Muskate Bank. Founded circa year 600, the temple blended in with the environment and remained unnoticed by the Hammerites for decades. By the time its existence became known, the temple had already obtained support of several powerful patrons, among whom was Francis Fitzgerald. His status as the district's beneficiary helped him ensure that the temple continued its existence, despite several shutdown attempts. It seemed as if such a situation would inevitably end in a bloody conflict, but rapid industrialization of the city during the next century has left its mark on Mosgate as well. As greenery disappeared, so diminished the pagan population, and consequently the temple's attendance. Under circumstances now muddied, Lord Maxwell Fitzgerald managed to convert the temple into a bank, circa 720, but remnants of the original structure can still be seen today. Since then, the bank has been operating successfully enough to sustain several generations of Fitzgeralds. Today, rumours about pagan ghosts and creepy laughter persist, but they are no doubt nothing more than wild stories of those who want to keep the mystery alive. You, you're nothing more than a wild story. Do you hear me? All right, now I'm just getting itchy. Does the guard even come in here or does he, or does he not? He might've walked up, up and down the hallway twice while I was here waiting for him to come into the room. For all I know. <coughs> He suddenly goes up the hallway. No, it doesn't seem like he comes in here. Oh, I guess books aren't valuable enough for you to guard, are they? I mean, yeah, I'm not going to steal them. Oh, it's a sensor thing for a, an old fashioned light. Oh, hello. Hello. Nothing valuable enough to guard, huh? Well, if we oh, nothing valuable enough to guard, huh? Valuable books. All right, what do we have here? Client list. Deposit box zero reserved for Fitzgerald. Deposit box two, Lord Felton. Oh, so Felton's key we saw was his deposit box key. Not. The key to his room, okay. 15, Lady Rosemary. Note, key was recently stolen in a robbery. Arrest anyone who comes in to access the box. 1D, strange old man in a green cloak. Wouldn't give a name. Keeper, haha. 1E, Lord Randolph. 21, Lord Wilson. 23, Lord Nichols. 24, Lord Bronson. Okay, so 15 and 24 are the keys I have. Is that correct? 15, 21 and 24. 21, of course, was in the sewers. So 15, 21, 24. So we got Wilson's, we got Bronson's. So Wilson's was in the sewers. Uh, let's just make a note. Wilson we probably don't need to get to. His key was in the sewers, so we got it. Okay. Bronson's... Bronson was 24 and we've got 24, so we've got Bronson's. Oh, that's the wrong one. Um, 
We have 15, 21, 24. I don't need to check the list. We've got Wilsons. Wilsons was in the sewers. 15 was in with the robbers. Actually, let's just write the numbers on here. 15 was there. 21 was there, and we got it. 21 got. 15 got. Although, it might be someone else marked here. Bronsons, we got. I didn't remember it, but we got it. Is Nichols on the client list? Lord Nichols has got 23, we haven't got it. Lord Felton was staying in Fitzgerald, has two. Zero might also be in Fitzgerald's place. Where's the map? So, O2 should be here. And O might be here? Or it might be in his office. Nichols has 23, which we have not got. Randolph, there's Randolph on the list there. We need to get into Randolph's for the art commission. Oh, we, we, yeah, he's got one E. Um, so we did, we've been in there, but we didn't get the, didn't find the key. I guess I didn't search his room well enough. Dang it, dang it, dang it, dang it. Don't even know how, oh, we got into Nichols. How did we get into Nichols? From somewhere around this way, I think. Maybe there was a window we could get into? I don't know. I don't know, I'm all confused. All right, we don't need to go into Bronson's again. That's, that's the good news. Anyway, we're here in the bank now. We might as well make some progress on... If we can disable the alarm while we're here, that's, that's probably worth... Worth doing. Where's he going? Yeah, he's going. Alright. Let's head to the upper floor, I think. Check the map of the bank. Head of security, yes. And this is the right, exactly the right, uh, place to be coming. We will need to get into Fitzgerald's office, but maybe that's here, maybe that's... Oh, manager's office, that's, that's there. Okay. Oh. Don't tell me you're coming to the stairway. I'd better not risk it, better wait and listen. He doesn't come here. That's good. Okay, get out of the light. Good. Because we want that door he just turned in front of. I'll take this door first. Banker's note. Felix, could you get the client list from the archives for me? I'd do it myself, but the basement gives me the creeps. Well, I don't need that. Because I have been to the archives already. All the rest is mere boring paperwork, okay. There's nothing on here, right? I saw something lit up for a moment. Huh? Shit. <laughs> That's the last time I jump for rats. Good. I would hate for you to run and press that alarm. And it might happen. But I would hate I would hate it. You know, it's not really my kind of fun. Oh, I thought he went. I thought he had a longer patrol than that. Okay. You know what? Let's open that so I can. Of course, the head of security's room is uh, locked pretty soundly. Alright, so this overlooks Randolph's. Hang on, was there another open window here? This window was half open. Or fully open. <laughs> Head of security's office key! Alright, this whoops, looks like a good place to be. No, don't use the keys on that. Silent alarm. Does that disable a silent alarm? I hope so. 
vault power room key. So sure, good. Uh, there's still. Let's just unlock that. There's still a vault code we need from the uh, manager's office. Right, if we get to the, if we can get to the power room, we can disable the vault. We can open the vault or disable the alarm or something. We've disabled the silent alarm. Maybe there's a noisy alarm too. Hello. I'm gonna drop that gold room specs. <laughs> well, good time. Good time for a nap. Good time for a nap. Actually, it gives, good, gives me a chance to scout and see if I can see anybody else around. Well, I can certainly see get some useful places to use my moss hours there. Might be more. Oh, right. There's three levers for the silent alarm. And they've all got to be triggered within a minute. I remember now. Okay, so let's make a note then. One of them is here. No, here. Call them A. And two were on the other floor by the uh, tellers. So, right, let me check my instructions just to be sure. Uh, three levers, two behind the tellers, one in the head of securities. Time's all, I only have about a minute to pull them. That's... I assume once I pull all of them, they all stay off, right? So that could be really inconvenient. Tell us down here. I guess if once I'm down there, if I stick a rope arrow in here, that'll be my quick way up to get to the head of security. Alright. I don't have much time here. Dang. <sighs> These doors locked. They're not, but I want them shut. I don't know. There's probably another guard out there. That's a kind of... Seems like a guardy sort of room. Although maybe there's nothing to guard. Maybe it's just a fancy room. Showing off rather than for uh, having anything value in there. Okay, the worst thing is I'm going to have to do all this again. Although, I don't know where the vault is. Alright, there's nobody in here. Maybe there is. There's probably lots of money in here, so I'm just counting it out and uh, got tired halfway through counting. Oh, this is stairs. Oh, so it is. Alright, the tellers are in the main, or in this area, so I guess one of the tellers there. One of the tellers there. Ah, uh, okay, so we're gonna have to come all the way around here. Alright, so I, I'm not gonna need that rope arrow, that's a bad plan, or meaningless plan. Okay. Well, since there's no access. That's, that's good security design, actually. You know, there's no access to the tellers area from uh, the floor they're on. So we come upstairs, past all the bank guards, in order to uh, get to them. Although, poor security, rather lax to leave uh, money there, but uh, that's good. It means I don't need to worry about this uh, noisy floor at all. Right, so there's another second one of the alarm keys. It's here, and I'm sure the third one is right there. I'm sure I don't need to uh, do anything about it. Now, What would my instructions say about the silent alarm, anyway? I won't be able to unlock the vault while the alarm is active. Okay, so I've got to disable the silent alarm. I'm confused why... Uh, why there seems to be... Uh, what sounds like talk of... Two alarm systems. This guy's quite happy and then humming to himself. 
good, it makes it easier to hear when he comes and goes. Huh? Okay, let's have a look in the courtyard. And you know, I should probably check out that courtyard at some point, but um... Not quite sure how to get in and out safely. Without more keys. I bet you there's another... Another guard wandering this hallway, right? Let's just scout for a minute. There is. So where does he go? Came out of that archway. So he came from this passage. So I bet he goes in and out of the lounge and we can get into the teller's room relatively safely, I hope. Alright, did he turn left? Maybe he went in there. Or did he just turn around? No, he turned left. You saw nothing. Alright, so that's the stairway down to the tellers. Oh, these guards are really going to make it a nuisance to get these levers if we've only got a mech. So we're going to have to, like, run for it. Where is this guard gone? Can't see him from this position. And it's too bright if I leave the window. Hear him. Must have maybe you went into the lounge? No. Nope. Oh, he's going into the lounge, okay. Alright, yep, here's the other side of the lounge switch, as we expected. I'll take that. Oh, there's any really other monies left here. Does he actually come up all this way? He doesn't. So you know what? I could... I could wait for him to come in... Hmm. Probably the archer. Alright. could wait till this guy just comes out of the lounge again. be able to hear him from here, right? When he comes out of the lounge. And then pull this and run upstairs. It's worth a try. Should be able to hear him from here. think. I'll take it. Let's hope it's safe here. No, it's the opposite of safe. Dang. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. Where do I need to go? Down the other stairs. to the head of security which is this door which I already unlocked all right uh, that's good that's the silent alarm done good result good result a little too stressful 
Alright, um, I haven't been to the guard captain's office and I probably should, so I need to wait for this guy to go back, but uh, now my stress levels can decrease. <laughs> Another bright patch. Let's check out the lounge behind him. Let's just follow him, I think. He does that little well, he does go up that, um... Oh, wait. oh, we need to be on the lookout for paintings here, too. I'm not gonna just sit with that. Well, what? I immediately forget my plan of following me. Oh, okay, it's way in there. Valuables here. Oh god, it's not gonna be bright enough. It's not gonna be dark enough here. Fitzgerald man manager, we have the key. And we need this vault code. Okay. Okay, okay, okay. Oh, don't push that button. Even if you've disabled it, I don't know if it's going to uh, help. So, you should the deposit box key. It's zero, zero. Okay, we've got that. Let's mark that on the map. I mean, it's Fitzgerald's anyway, so let's just mark it there, even if it wasn't here. So they can't put them back, right? <laughs> Fitzgerald's journal. 1101. This month's vault code is 6439. 1103. met with D today and explained the situation with the old vault. He said his boys would be able to help me out. Now I need to make sure that they don't pocket all that gold themselves. 1105. Everything is ready for the meeting with Lord Caldwell tomorrow. We need to win him as a client. His connections will help elevate our bank's status. 1109. Lord Caldwell meeting was an utter failure. And on top of that, nobody from D's party returned. Now I'm left with all the damage control to do before we lose any more money. Wish I could just get away from all this for a while. Dang, does that mean Lord Calder's gold is not going to be in the vault? Uh, anyway, let's read the journal. It says 6439. Let's make a note. I guess the vault is on the ground floor, right? Vault here. 6439. Oh, I can't, I can't put the journal back. Alright, never mind. So he's got the alarm under his desk, but nothing else under his desk. I think he's... No, he's coming to the lounge, is he? Yeah. That's the way the captain's office, but what have we got here? Dang it, nothing. What have we got here? Someone shot an arrow in there. Wait, what? Was that just a broader arrow? I misread. Someone's been taffing about. I'm having their dinner, some having some fun. Uh, we are in this room, okay. Someone behind me? I think you mean in front of you? Can't hear it anymore. Probably nothing. You don't come in here, do you? Uh, probably not. Hopefully not. I think not. Wait, did he just go in another door? <laughs> Not dark enough. 
Did that shadow move? Oh, you're there, okay. You gotta stop jumping at nothing. <laughs> Alright. That's a nice room for me. This one's probably locked, right? Oh, it's not even accessible. It's the guard captain. Is there no guard captain? Peters, guard captain. How come his room is not even accessible? Oh, well, I know. I bet we can only get there from the courtyard. Okay, and uh, if we come down this, we haven't actually explored the ground floor at all. Barracks. I guess there'll be a way into the courtyard, yeah, from here. Oh, there's the vault. Uh, 6439. It's right there. So we could get to the vault right now. We have, I guess we have 4 deposit box keys. We do have four. We have enough for our objective. Uh, I guess we're gonna miss out on a couple of them. That's all right. We'll miss out on Lord Felton's and whatnot. Well, uh, it happens. Sir, was that you? Yep, it was me. Nothing making noise now. <coughs> Barracks, huh? <coughs> That's the vault room there. With the, we could put the code in and go in right now, but um, okay, the gallery is where we're going to find out the painting. There's a guard here. Probably make a note just for future reference. I do want to explore the entire ground floor, but uh, maybe we can do our business in the vault before we do that. New objectives. Cut little gold isn't here, but maybe this job can be salvaged. Get into the old vault and find the gold mentioned in Fitzgerald's journal. Oh, the old vault. Right, no one's going to notice this door open, are they? Let's hope it's not locked. Wow, look at all these vault things. Which ones do we have? Uh, instructions. We have 0, 15, 21, and 24. Twenty-one. Twenty-one. Well, twenty-one was reported stolen, but they still left goods in there, so, hmm. That seems kind of uh, foolish on the part of the bank staff. Irresponsible, one might say. Old vault key obtained. Nice. So the old vault must be uh, down in the basement, then. What's in this one? A crown. Okay, we've got plenty of gold. And uh, let's lock this back up. Well, there's a lot of vault keys we're not going to get. I guess most of them aren't actually accessible. I was like, what if all of them are really, really hidden away? It's just like, I'll oh, get three, get four, get five, and there's actually like 50 of these. Alright, let's. Listen. Can I even listen to the door this size? Do I just risk opening it? Risk being seen? Well, it seems pretty safe. He thinks. Oh, it's upstairs. All right, um... Oh, he's coming. Let's not dash out. 
wondering if I can close the gate in front of it, but maybe... I mean, it never opened it, so... Maybe it only closes when the alarm is tripped. Or maybe disabling this island alarm opens it, I don't know. I didn't really come to scout this place out before getting everything needed. <clears throat> Normally the vault, you know, a vault door would lock itself again. <laughs> hey, what happens if I push this again? I can't. Well, I don't have the key for that. Okay, fine. This stuff is alarmed. Well, they use those fuzzes anyway. What have we got? <laughs> Cheap imitations. Now that's the real deal. Yeah, pointless, cheap nonsense. God, wander in here, or was I just hearing one upstairs? Uh, possible I heard a guard wander in here. Now, is there anything of value in this room? Presumably not, right? They look the clients in here. But then, wait, there might just be. This guard might just have something of value on his belt. One never knows. Seems clear. Where's this guard? Right outside the door. But going the way I want. I'm gonna go, go his direction too. Let's see where it's where he turns left. down that hallway, all right. Well, there is an archer in, aha. Yeah, that window is open. How would one get up to it? Importantly, how would one stay here, get in here without being seen? No. Oh, uh, wait, no, that's Fitzgerald's room, not the Security guy. How am I going to hmm, manage this? Why am I in the gardens at all? There's going to be lots of gold in here. Maybe someone's thrown something in the fountains. So I should check. But uh, um, yeah, Fitzgerald's window there doesn't really do me any good. There's fish in the fountain. Not gold, but fish. Yeah, not. Not really gonna help me. Oh, we can open this door into fish shops, okay. Flashbang you, aren't I? Okay, you taffer. I'll find you. What's that? Don't! You oh, I had dented the armor a little. Come back here and fight. Dang. That went perfectly. Used both my flash bombs and left one guard alerted. I, the guy inside got flashed by the first one, but I was busy focusing on the uh, archer. All right, where are you? I'm not here. 
Oh, I have a plan. I have an escape plan. <sighs> Why is he giving up already? Good. Come on. Get me away from the door. On the plus side, it means I have more free reign to check for gold in these fountains, but no, there's only gold fish. Oh! <laughs> gold fish! <laughs> nice! Uh, this one wasn't wasn't probable, right? This is just a uh, yeah ordinary fish. <laughs> I like it. From deep beneath the ground, the natural spring water flows into this very garden. Even in the coldest months, this place stays fresh and green. Okay. Uh, so, what do we need to do in Fitzgerald's? The only thing to do in Fitzgerald's was to try and find Felton's keeper. I don't know where to find the keeper's door. If it was wooden, I could break it down, but that would absolutely get all the guards on me. We're gonna do without Fitzgerald's, Randolph's, and Nicholas's keys. Oh, the one I want, the keeper glyph. I am. Um, I am sad about missing out on that one. Uh. But alright, we have we have the western wing of the bank of the bank's ground floor to check out. So the guard wanders up here. I wonder if I can stand here. Do we have a door shadow? We do have a door shadow. Good. Watch out for. Yep. Where does he go? He comes in here. If you see me, I'm going to be most upset. No, he won't see me. If you don't get more tuneful, I'll be most upset. So he's going between the waiting room and whatever this room is. Does. Oh no, he's he's waiting in there. Ah, of course. What about this room? Is there any places to hide here? There are. Okay, let's quickly check out this room. It's just me, bank staff, working late. Don't mind me. Scribble, scribble. Scribble, clink, clink, count coins. Oh, where's he going now? Ah, oh, to the stairwell. Okay. for him to come in and out so I can check out this desk and there's nothing there and of course there's nothing at this stairwell either. That's fine, he's gonna wait in his waiting room. And where am I gonna wait for him? How about here? I guess there was the uh, dark corner here by the waiting room which is actually gonna be more convenient. Let's leave that open. The old vault. It's gonna be a thing. Oh, 
not going to be gone long. So let's be quick. Alright, there's nothing there. Waiting room. Golly. When I said he's not going to be gone long, I thought he was going to be gone longer than that. That was almost uh, dangerous. Oh, there's the other guard. What's oh, this one? Sorry, got too confused. All right, <clears throat> this is the hallway guard. Yeah, there's the there's the other one. Okay. Be a little bit careful because he could spot us from there. There's a nice big pillar. Hello? Is someone there? Of course not. All right. Back to the basement then. Let's use these stairs. Um. Yeah. Hello, anyone there? Let's wait for this guy to. Uh, where is he going? Where he goes. Oh, I don't know. I don't remember where he goes. He just goes up to the hall and back. All right. Wait for him to pass by. And we shall do the same. <clears throat> Who is there? Is someone there? Why would you think anyone was there? What a ridiculous concept. Oh yeah, we got this guy to follow. Oh, he's gonna go in there actually and let us get past. Perfect. Perfect. Oh no, there's the, comes the other guard. Who... There's nothing. That's the last time I jump for rats. All right. Let's check out the old vault. Hello. What's going on here? Oh, of course, the guys never came back. These fellows. What did the journal say? Explain the situation and said his boys would be able to help out. Oh, these are the downwinders, I suppose. There's gold here. Nobody from D's party has returned. Okay, this is bad news for me, especially this metal door that we have to walk over. So what is going on in the old vault? As the mission is in fact named after it. Well, I guess we'll find out in the next episode. So thanks very much for watching, and I hope to see you then.